Did you eat candy this morning? Always a waiting game. Still trying to wake up. Gonna be heading to Jeb's house today. Gonna do some filming up there. He's got a lot of new projects. Should be very interesting. Mangy, a little bit. My goals for 2017 was to kind of document my days. Not necessarily like journal, like a daily journal, but every once in a while I just kind of put what I'm going through on the channel. Basically that's what I was doing. Just writing down how many subs I got today, how many videos are up, what plans are, just what's going on, you know? Kind of document it. And uh, I think it'll be interesting at the end. I can go back and look at it. I don't know, maybe make copies for you guys. Bye. Bye bye. I'll see you later, okay? It's tough because my goals this year one is to do 200 videos in 2017, which is uh, going to be a huge uh, undertaking just because I've only got. Been doing this for years and I've only got 250 videos, 257 videos on the channel. So, but I want to do 200 new videos this year. That's one of my goals. The other goal is to make longer videos. I know you guys ask for those a lot of, a lot of times. And um, I think it's beneficial as far as uh, the YouTube algorithm goes. So, longer videos, 10 minutes plus. I don't want them too long. But those two things uh, kind of counteract each other. Make more videos and then to make them longer well it's hard enough to make a video let alone to make it a long video and now i gotta do 200 of them anyways it's it's good for you guys to set lofty goals i'm gonna try to do better about that i'm not very good about setting lofty goals i felt like last year i kind of winged it you know i just kind of took the opportunities that were right there in front of me and didn't really go after any really big ones so i'm gonna try to change it this year I also want you guys to know that, uh, you know, I kind of portray this uh, grind hard all the time, good mood, upbeat, killing the game type of persona, but it's not always like that. Sometimes it's just like it is this morning where I just want to hang out in the bed and stay at home with my kids. I don't really want to drive two hours to work all day to drive two hours home and have a bunch of uh, film I need to edit. So sometimes it's hard, you just gotta make yourself do it. Those uh, those things will pay off at some point. So anyway, I just wanna throw that out there. It's not always easy for me, just as I'm sure it's not easy for you guys.
Well, I made it. I'm here at the infamous Cutworm Specialties. Got a lot going on. SRT, SRT8 Jeep, uh, speed speed Jeep, 180 mile an hour, big turbo. Putting a uh, belly pan on it. It's got his drift ride that we're doing a full feature on today. You'll see that on the channel soon. It's a cool little ride. The Radical still getting worked on. Been collecting footage over the last, I don't know, four or five visits on this thing. Going to do a full feature video on it once it's done. We're kind of collecting footage throughout the build so we can feature that thing too. So, anyway, so uh, get some filming done. You guys, stay tuned. This is kind of just a vlog style on all the stuff he's got going on in here. I'll uh, put some footage of everything that's going on. But uh, gonna do like a more of a feature video on his new drift ride, and um, hope you guys dig it. visit up here North Carolina to see Jeb do some filming see what he's up to he's always got something cool going on it's always uh, really nice to, to just take a drive it's about an hour and a half drive up here gives me time to think and reflect um, just kind of alone time quiet no distractions I have a hard time slowing down sometimes and just thinking about life, the channel, family, everything that's going on. Anyways, as always, thank you for joining me. Hope you guys dig it. I'll have some more stuff up this week. I've got a bunch of footage that needs to go up, so stay tuned for that. And uh, go do work, son.